Good morning, everybody. Happy Thursday. Everybody's on their phones. <laughs> um, so have you guys, have you, I don't know where this, where you guys are at with this, but have you guys heard of um, chat GPT? Yeah, do you guys use it to do your homework? No. No? <laughs> Can you? All the time, yeah. You could? Oh. You do use it or you could use it? I do use it. Do you? Yeah. What do you use it for, Tanner? Um, I had it do my introductory paragraph on my argumentary essay. Anybody else use it that way? No, but I've, I sound like a news student without people using it to write essays. Okay. All my friends use it for math, too. For math? Um... Okay, this is kind of fun because it's it's still pretty new. I mean, I was looking into it and it like it's been out a little bit. Do you guys know who started it? Um, it was a guy named Sam something, and Elon Musk started it, um, which doesn't surprise me. But um, anyway, so a little 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 rewind a little bit. So um, there's a pretty famous clip on the internet of the Today Show, uh, like it's a morning news program where they talk about when they first learn about what the internet is. And it was in 1994 and I was 12 years old. So a little younger or about the same age as you guys is when the internet kind of basically started. And you go back and look at that clip and those guys sound like idiots. They're like, what's the internet? It's really, really funny. They don't get it. And so I imagine that as we have a conversation about chat GPT and other things that I kind of want to watch this video in 20 years and see how dumb we sound because I think it's one of those things that's almost as impactful. So, um, so I actually, this is kind of fun, but I told chat GTP to write me a script for Thursday thoughts with Brad. So it did. Oh. So it said, that it's, there should be an opening shot of Brad sitting in front of a bookshelf, looking at the camera with a friendly smile. So there's my intro, you guys, <laughs> okay? And then it told me that I should say, hi everyone, welcome to Thursday Thoughts with Brad. And today we're gonna talk about the buzzing topic of chat GPT. And so I told it to tell to like do my script so that I could just read this whole thing. And I can't read while I drive, but it did this whole, um, Thursday thought with Brad in 27 seconds. Usually it takes me, I don't know, an hour of reading or, you know, kind of going through a book that I'm going through. Like it, it, it doesn't take me 27 seconds to prepare for Thursday thoughts with Brad. But if I just wanted to read it, I just told chat DTP and it did as good a job as I probably could do like researching on my own. So anyway, I, I think it's awesome. Um, I think that uh, this is, I don't know if this is gonna be your generation's internet, it might be, um, but what I think is something that you guys should think about, because this is something, I mean, Tanner's already using it all the time, but one of the biggest things that you'll have to be aware of is being careful with how you use it, okay? In fact, when I asked ChatGTP to write my script, it says this, I'll try and kind of scam this or skin, skim this, but it says, so what does this mean? Well, it means that we're all living in a time of incredible technological change. And let's see, we need to stay informed about the potential risks and benefits of AI models um, and ensure that they're working at the benefits for everybody. So there's a lot of risks with this. I, I'm sure you guys can see that. Like. You could cheat on your homework. People could create fake information, fake news. Like there's a lot of downside to this type of a technology, but there's a ton of upside too. So, um, you know, you can, if you guys think about like, if you were ever on the internet trying to buy something and you have those chat features, have you ever guys seen those on the, like when you're shopping, you wanna ask a question? That's not a person anymore, okay? That's. <laughs> That's, a, that's this technology that's just answering your questions in a lot of cases. So it's gonna change a lot of things, but I just thought it was fun to play around with. Um, it's still one of those things that uh, I think we're gonna have to get take getting used to, but I'm excited to for you guys to have that and to 
to make the world a better place with that kind of technology. So anyway, I thought it was fun. There's my chat GPT AI technology um, Thursday thought with Brad, you guys. So anyway, love you guys. Have a good day.